Hey, it's Toby, Terraset Technologies. Um, and we're continuing with our PLC next. So I created this program called Station. I haven't done anything with it. Um, and you can look right here. It says Program Station is not used. So if I want to use the program, um, yeah, let's just say that we put it yeah, we add it here, we could say, um, since station is going to be like a generic for any station in the line, then we could just say like line one, station one. And then we can call it program type, and it's going to be station. So then that little alarm goes away. Um, but if I come over here, and this is along the lines of doing like a pack ML. So I brought in structured text. Um, that's just what I put the code at. And then if we think about the variables, uh, I want to be able to add the, the states that we went through. So, and really what I should be doing is like a UDT If I add this, let's add a new data type and let's call it station states. And let's see if it will give me the template. Collapse on enable. We'll just copy like from here. So let's just do it this way. If I copy this, oh, there it goes, insert template. But I do it like so. Yeah, so let's go array abstract, in the struct, array abstract, my struct, blah, blah, blah. That doesn't look the same. So I am going to delete this. Control V. Alright, so we got a digital type. We want a digital input struct. Um, what I'm going to change that to is station. It's called modes, I guess. Um, station equipment modes and why did it do it like that? I don't know. So we're going to have stopped. We're going to have stopping. We are going to have Resetting. Idle. And we will come back and look at this. So I'm going to pause and come back so that you guys have seen it. Watch me for 10 minutes. Alright. So I've got. I've got all of my equipment modes. In my. Station equipment mode structure. So we're going to save this. I'm going to make sure that I don't have any errors. Um, which, thinking about it, thinking about it, thinking about it. Do, 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 ding, 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 ding. Whatever the... And... So what we also got to change is this right here because we made it this whole array. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. 17. Du, du. Um, we'll do that. And then we're going to change station equipment. Maybe we're going to change station equipment. Station equipment. 
modes. Destruct array. Uh, modes. Destruct. Alright, yeah, so that cleared, so I'm gonna resave it. So these are all my modes. Um, so now, because I made it a UDT and it's a station state, I should be able to go over here to variables in station and say stations. We're just going to say states. And I'm going to call it type station states, and if I remember my ABCs, it should be at the end of the drop down. And this is something that I get to learn because, um, state status, I don't think it's that one. Station equipment mode struct. Station equipment mode struct array. So which one do we want? Because I would have thought that it would just be Alright, I would have thought it would have just been, you know, that we could go to station state, but um, apparently it doesn't work that way. So, station equipment mode struct. So, let's see how that plays out as. So, if I want to come over here and state dot. Yeah, so I'm able to bring in the other states, right? Yeah. I'm going to change that to non-plural. Not sure if it matters, but state dot. So I have all of these that I can use, and right now, um, we have them as local. So within this container of station, so I can duplicate, um, I can duplicate everything that is in that UDT using the station state for within station. And then when I use that as a program, yeah, it's going to be line one, station one. Well, I can also duplicate it later for line one, station two. Um, so at this point, what I'm going to do is figure out the conditions that I want for each of these states and create a state machine and structure text. So wish me luck. <laughs>